from one of our favorite, or actually our favorite, coffee shop and bistro here on the island, Rooster on the Go. It's also right next to our apartment, but that's not why it's our favorite. Rooster is a, an idea that um, two of my brothers had. I was actually living in the States uh, five years ago when they uh, come to visit me and says, we want to um, start a new restaurant. I um, moved to Isla Mujeres. A couple of months later, we had the idea that start Rooster on the Go, that it was um, a little more like a, the coffee shop or the smaller version of Rooster. The location was uh, very, very easy because uh, number one was one of the uh, few empty spaces on the island on downtown for the moment. But at the same time, we are very close to one of the uh, biggest hostels here in Isla Mujeres, that is a uh, Pogna. Rooster on the Go started with the idea of a, uh, my brothers and Jason Herman, that is my partner. And um, we started this as a, um, a bakery, coffee shop. But at the same time, a, uh, we wanted to do something new if, um, that is not a, that no, nobody tried before on the island. Jason was uh, in charge of all the baking goods, all his recipes. Uh, some of his family and some others are uh, new ones. We have a um, coffee that is a uh, roasted and packed here in Cancun, but it's a coffee from uh, Costa Rica. We're here for almost three years now, and just recently this uh, year we added all the patio. And who did all your design? Mm -hmm. Your design in here is awesome. Uh, thank you. She's an architect from here from Cancun. Very, very nice uh, uh, girl that uh, she helped us with this. This is Jason, the muscle behind the operation, and the baker. Yeah. What else do you do besides everything? Everything. Make coffees, make salads, and do the baking. Are you responsible for that potato salad? Yes, it's my, it, is, it is actually my recipe, yes. So. Oh my god, the potato salad here is... Sorry, Grandma. The, it's the best potato salad I've ever had in my entire life. Thank you. It's very good. I've been on the island for five years, originally from Oregon as well, but Central Oregon most of my life. Um, then moved here and was working in the bakery, took over the bakery and came up with uh, all the recipes for the bakery. Just wanted something that was you know, a little more closer to home that you can't find here in Mexico, because the bread here in Mexico is very good, but, but I wanted something that was more my style than it took. And by very good, he means okay. Okay. And I, you know, it took me a little bit of adjusting to uh, to the the being at sea level baking ra rather than the higher altitude where I was from. But it all it all worked out really good in the end. That's fantastic. Well, thank you so much. Welcome, thank you. Kate is addicted to his cinnamon creations, so uh, we spend a fair amount of time in our budget here. Today. culture and environment and it's just really you know calm and comforting and you never feel out of place here so that's why I love boosters for sure. Hi <laughs> and yeah I come here every day to have my um, coffee it's a uh, cup that with almond milk and I love it it's better than any German coffee and yeah you can't beat it so come on in and check it out. <laughs> you heard it here better than any German coffee but Alex She's not talking about your coffee. Your coffee is probably still better German coffee. Boo, what's your favorite? <laughs> well, as you can see, <laughs> cinnamon roll and the uh, mocha frappuccino. Cinnamon roll and mocha frappuccino? <laughs> All right, I think we're awesome. Thanks, bro. No, no, you're welcome. Thank you. I came here for the coffee. I stayed for the rooster. For the rooster. I always say something. And if you move around, it follows you. It does. <laughs> 